I've had my hair for all my life, so I don't want to cut it. Dreadlocks can be a fashion statement, but they're also sacred. It's my religion, so it means like a lot. Chikazi's hair holds a number of religious meanings, including the biblical command not to cut one's hair. I'm Rastafarian, and and I um, I shouldn't cut my hair. Chikazi's school doesn't buy that. His head teacher threatened him with suspension if he didn't cut off his dreadlocks, and he was taught in isolation. At 12 years old, just weeks into his new school life. Chikazi had to move to another school to keep his dreadlocks. If I'm following that fate, and if this is my fate, I have to abide by that rule. I cannot abide by anybody else's rule but the Creator's rule. What do we want? Equality! When do we want it now? Fulham Boys School, a Church of England academy, is accused of religious discrimination. The ban on dreadlocks has sparked global newspaper headlines. There's a growing petition and today a protest by the Rastafarian community outside the school gates. But Fulham Boys School is not backing down, maintaining its position that it has a strict uniform policy, that every pupil, whatever their culture, whatever their background or religion, must stick to. Let's stop the racism at Fulham Boys School. I don't know what's going on with society these days, but we have to address this as parents and as rasters. What do we want? Equality! What do we want it now? We've consulted with lawyers who have all said that the school's position is unlawful. So uh, we have it on good authority that the school's position is untenable. Um, it's in conflict with the law. In fact, Ofsted guidance warns schools that while they can impose their own uniform policies, they should be willing to adapt to accommodate religious beliefs, unless they can justify a reason not to. Fulham Boys Schools say they see dreadlocks as a social issue, not a religious one. They may have to argue that in court. Chickasie's family are seeking legal action. Chris Rogers, BBC London News, Fulham.